Hi, I'm Richard Armitage, and my debut novel is called Geneva. It's a high-stakes, high-concept destination thriller about betrayal and deception. Sarah Collier is a retired Nobel Prize-winning scientist who is suffering the uh, symptoms of early-onset dementia, and she is lured to Geneva by her husband, Daniel Collier, to endorse a revolutionary neural implant, and when she gets to Geneva, things are not quite what they seem. Hello, I'm Richard Armitage, and I'm going to read a short extract from my new book, Geneva. A shard of ancient granite thrusts upwards through the white origami folds of the Swiss Alps, piercing the low-hanging cloud. A kestrel soars high above the summit of the most iconic mountain in Europe, the Matterhorn. To the northwest, a high-altitude lake lies in the deep valley carved by glaciers. The city of Montreux and Lausanne are busy with travellers moving across the network of autobahns like veins carrying vital blood to the principal body, the shining city of Geneva. A melting pot of winter thrill-seekers, millionaires and bright minds, all of them ready to take on the late November evening. But up here in the majestic stillness of the peak, the silent air holds the kestrel in suspension. Caught in a passing updraft, the span of feathers ripples in the freezing air. The bird begins to turn in a spiral, descending towards the pine forest below. Everything is calm, everything quiet, the mirror-still water of the distant lake glowing in the fading light of the winter sun. The crack of a gunshot blasts through the silence, shattering the calm. The kestrel shears away. The trees shudder and release a flock of fleeting birds in a cloud of powder snow. A pair of mountain chamois leap from the undergrowth in startled flight. Deep in the forest, a woman sprints over the freshly packed snow, weaving through the trees in desperation, hot breath pumping out into the freezing air as she climbs hard. The runner groans in exhaustion, but she must not give up. She pushes forwards, struggling against the deepening snow that slows her with each passing step. She has to keep going. It can't end here. 